Do you believe he in the Ten Commandments? Him. Yeah. Why? It's in the Old Testament. You can't use that. <laughs> I mean, I, I believe that. No, you can't. It's a good basis, man. Why? It's the Old Testament, though. That's done away with, right? No, not the, not the yeah, law. Got, the law of the Old Testament that's is the, done away. The, the, that's the Ten Commandments is the law. That is the law. Now shall not commit adultery. Now shall not uh, steal and kill. I got something, brother. This is, uh, this is Ecclesiastes uh, 15 and 20. He hath commanded no man to do wickedly, neither hath he given any man license to sin. Right, a license to sin. Now a sin, the biblical definition of sin is uh, breaking the law. Like eating pork is a sin. Uh, sleeping with your, uh, having sex with your sister is a sin. That's not the Ten Commandments. Okay, hold up. Is it okay to have sex with your mother and sister? Because it's not in the Yeah, table. man. What? You do that all the time. Oh, man. Come on, man. You got to be serious, bro. I got to serious. Hold up. Let's see. Lot's, Lot's two daughters. Monday. Oh, you can't be serious. Monday. You know you know the Lord cursed him for that, yeah. right? He well, turned man, him to a I nation. Wasn't, I wasn't saying it. Because he turned, he turned his descendants into heathens for that as a punishment. Because Lot was pretty much an Israelite, yep, yep, and his, his descendants were not. Just weren't called Israelites. Right, exactly. Well, they were. He's of the chosen line. Yep. And he got yeah, punished. Lot was a man and of God. Still gave, and still gave birth to him. Yep. That was a punishment. Two giant nations. And no motherfucking Moab and Israel. Giant nations. Yeah, he's a huge nation. Especially Moab. Woo. I got this person. This in the New Testament. Luke 24, 44. And he said unto them, These are the words which I spoke unto you, which I was yet with you, that all things must be fulfilled, which were written in the law of Moses. Written in the law of Moses. But that's the Old Testament, though. You can't you can't use the New Testament now because the New Testament that we're supposed to follow. I guess the New Testament's no good now. Okay, read that again. Luke. 24:44, and he said unto them, These are the words which I spake unto you while I was yet with you, that all things must be fulfilled, which were written in the law of Moses and in the in the prophets and in the Psalms concerning me. They prophesied in the Lord in the Old Testament. I that, was, that was clear as day. Straight to the point. And it wasn't that prophecy was not in the Ten Commandments. Yet. You know what I mean? That's that's why these churches are off, bro. We're trying to tell you. Dude, that's all if you if you want to ensure your destruction and doom, <laughs> go to one of these churches. You see your, your, your doom and your death is sealed. That's why he's acting is like it, a zombie right now. Your death is assured. <laughs> and actually most of these they churches the truth. I don't know if your church is or not, but most churches are under a 501c3 tax exempt status, meaning they, they have an agreement with the government and they can only teach certain things, otherwise they'll lose their status. Anything okay. pertaining to huge issues like homosexuality, like what we've been talking about. Anybody like Alex Jones talks about all the time, how you got uh, actual CIA plants in the church. Okay. And, 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 then the pre and then the preachers are taking tabs on everybody in the church. And they're giving a report to the government saying, well, this person owns guns, uh, this person uh, uh, is against the government, and they're they, they're writing reports on it, keeping tabs on it. That is true. What they call it? Uh, I forget. A I, dossier. Yeah, like a dossier, a dossier on it. Yeah, keep a dossier on it. That is true. Yeah. I can hit this. Uh, second John. Just do a snot rocket. This is Second John. Uh, <laughs> Second John one and six, and this is love. This now, this is the biblical definition of love. That we walk after His commandments, which is the law. This is the commandment that, as ye have heard from the beginning, ye shall walk in it. Right, going all the way back to the beginning. Like, what did happen in the beginning? The first commandment ever was, "Don't eat the fruit." And you eating the fruit, you know, a big old chunk out there. And you say it was delicious. It's very pleasing to the eyes. It would be free, man. It doesn't align with what God is saying. We ain't just read what he's saying, bro. We read the Bible. This ain't the Quran. We ain't reading read it on a comic book. I can find a scripture that says homosexuality is okay. I'm sure I can no, find 
Yeah. Yeah, you can, there's no scrimmage. Hands down. <laughs> Not a single scrimmage. Yeah, this is that. love that we walk after his commandments. This, this is, is the, the love for God, man. This is love. No, the love that you love. should have for Christ. He just told you what love was. Read it again. And this is love. And this is love. That we walk after his commandments. That we, that's love. Bro. Love for him. Not for anything else. Love for God. You walk after His commandments. You love God yeah, enough to obey to Him. Right. So, and what are the so if someone's breaking the commandments, th that's not love. I got one. So what are the commandments? I got the commandments. I got the commandments. Oh, yeah. The Vedicus 20 13. This is love right here. If a man also lie with mankind as he lieth with a woman, both of them have committed an abomination. They shall surely be doomed to death. They did. Their they blood. Did shall be upon them. He been marked up. Yeah, he been marked it. You so got tattoos all over you, bro. I do. I got that. Hey, you, uh, you seen that movie, uh, uh you seen that movie, Nights of Bad Oh, uh, You ain't seen that? This dude got some scriptures stuck on his head. That's what he, like he said, he got tattooed up with scriptures. He got, he got hit with so many scriptures. He got hit with the scripture Blitzkrieg. Matthew, this is Matthew 5 and 17. Think not that I have come to destroy the law. Think not that I come to destroy the law. The law is a most. Don't eat pork, don't be a faggot, don't commit incest. <laughs> Keep going. Or the prophets. Or the prophets. I am not come to destroy, but to fulfill. Keep going. For verily I say unto you, until <laughs> heaven and earth pass, up? one jot or Wait one up. little shell in no wise pass from the law. Right, hold on, we're trying to read scripture. Don't so interrupt in the word of God. Heaven. They're interrupting the word of the Most High. That's what some of Satan would do. Let's go. Read it again. For verily I say unto you, till heaven and earth pass, one jot, listen, one, one tittle listen, tittle, listen, tittle, listen, and no wise pass from the law. I mean, no but this is a key point right here. This is key. So all be fulfilled. Keep going. Whosoever therefore shall break one of these least commandments. Break a least commandment. Eat pork. Eat pork. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, how do you listen not? now? Who listen. Whosoever listen. therefore shall break one of listen. these least commandments. Listen. This is this is the Sermon on the Mount. You wanted to read the Sermon on the Mount? We're reading it. Read it. Read that again. At the top. Uh, Where's break one of these least. Commandments. Matthew's five. 17. That's the Sermon on the Mount. Read it. I'm sorry from the top. He asked for it, didn't he? Matthew's five and seventeen. That's Think not, not that I am come to destroy the law. Like I have come to fulfill the law. Right. I know what it says. Let's get back to that one part where it says, uh, you break one of these commandments. Just read that part. Matthews 5 and 17. Matthews 5 and 19. Whosoever therefore shall break one of these least commandments and shall teach men so. You're teaching us it's okay to eat pepperoni pizza. Keep going. <laughs> I'm not saying Listen, that. listen. He shall be called the least in the kingdom of heaven. He shall be called the least in the kingdom. Keep going. Oh, snap, crack the pot. Keep going. But whosoever shall do and teach them, the same shall be called great in the kingdom of heaven. So I'm 100% confident that what we are teaching is the truth. Six foot. 100%. 100% truth, bro. You, you can't deny it. Come on, you can't deny that. You, that's a, the Sermon on the Mount. Can't deny it. We're teaching the truth. The Spirit brought it out because he mentioned it, didn't he? Yeah, he bro, mentioned it. He brought it out, didn't he? It is. Nah, a, it is a, it out because I brought it out, man. So, come on, bro. Like, you can't deny that. And so if you deny that right there, You'll be called at least in the kingdom. So you can't get around it. And we try and we ain't we, we ain't beat the shit out of you, we throw stones at you. We hit we reading the scripture. Trying to tell you. But it's the scripture said uh You know how I know you're wrong? Oh god. How, how can we that's not us. You mean how you know that I, I'll show you God. You wanna see God? No, no, rephrase You wanna that. see God? No, you wanna see you wanna see God? I'll we show you. I'll we show just you God, it. my we man. Just just listen, it. I just told you what I did before I came here. Did I and, and and while I was while I've been standing here for the past hour, okay, 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 okay. I've seen one man of God that I know personally walk by here. I've seen a group of ten people that, that I know personally. Kept going and we they got they here kept going. Throwing the word they out. Should, if I see somebody reading the Bible, right. I'm stopping, bro. I don't I don't care if he it's teaching it wrong. I, I want. There, there you go. I, 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 I want to talk about it. But did they even stop and say hi? They just kept going. <laughs> they said, hey, he's kept going. Well, I didn't see him. <laughs> everything else comes second to this word. Every, everything else is second. Do, 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 they, do, they worship, do they worship other gods? Yeah, they worship other gods. And them girls, some of girls look good too. So, so they don't celebrate. Why is Christmas? lust, man? Lust is a sin. How is that lust? Like, how how, can how you is that say lust? That? Explain to me. How, no, lust is you when you look at another man's wife. 
No, no lust no. is when you lust upon a woman. No, it's not. With lust in oh, your no, eyes. No, wrong, 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 incorrect. Wrong. You're supposed to want. <laughs> the Lord said to be fruitful and multiply. Okay. <laughs> be fruitful. What does that mean to be Don't fruitful? Mean go plant now, plant now that, but the Bible said we can have as many women as we want. Oh, shit. What? No. Yes, I can have a thousand women if I want. That's no. scriptural. That's scriptural. <laughs> How many wives did Abraham have? How many wives did David have? Abraham had two, what, had two wives, but he only had what, two wives what, after his first wife when died. David would have, when King David, a man after the God most, convicted King David no, and killed his first son that's because called, no, he that's something else. That's something else. That's, that's adultery. King David committed adultery. He committed, now that's wrong, and the Lord punished him for it. God fucked him up, too. However, back to, on his deathbed, they brought a young virgin to him on his deathbed. That's right. And they knew he was about to die, but he did not want that virgin. A young sweet thing, let's, too. Let's get that. That's first king. Go read it for you. A young sweet thing, too. What about Solomon? Oh, shoot. Solomon. That's too many, see. That's good. Yeah, right, that, right now, in this kingdom, you don't want a lot of women. And yeah, actually, no. that's why Paul said, if you're a de uh, well, a bishop, like the bishop is only supposed to have wife. one wife. So if, if you're a head of the church in your city, you should only have one wife. But everybody else can have as many women as they want. That's what Paul said. He said, let the bishop be have one wife. <laughs> What's up, ho? They gonna die in that car by fire. She's a ho, though. She's <laughs> wooing. You know what I'm saying? She probably, oh, I guarantee you, I get her to do all kind of. She would Jesus do anything Christ you was want. standing here right now, what would he have said to that? Well, he would have called her a hoe. He, he would have hit that bitch with a cosmic fireball. That's not true. He would have. Woman by the well. Would have, but he cursed her out. No, no he didn't. Hey, did he no, said he, 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 he told called her a hoe. He said, how many husbands do you have? He said, you lying to me. He said, you have five husbands and you oh, know. Oh, oh yeah, and yeah, he called the Canaanite woman a dog. Oh, that one, she was actually an Israelite, though. Yeah, that's not me. Man, he, he actually called the king, uh, the king that woman, she was great of faith. But the woman by the well, he cursed her out and told her she was a liar. That's no. what, yes, he did. Pull out the scripture. No, I, got, I got that, I got that, I got that King James. Oh, go ahead, read. She, he bounced it Yeah, you got to think of one second. Right. He bounced it That's because I'm busting you with Christ. Uh, I'm busting you with Christ. That's, that's really I'll what the unlearned You know the scripture, I know the stories of the meeting. And that's really what the unlearned do. They one place and another, man. They just everywhere, man. And they call us. He's everywhere, man. What are you know, talking about? Let me read this book. Read it. King David was a man after the most high, the only part. He made me look That's good. in the book of Acts. She said, David is a man after the Most High's own heart. You know, first kings, uh, the, the, Lord, the Lord, the one you call Jesus Christ, was also known as the son of David. Okay? That's because he da now, King David was old and stricken in years, and they covered him with clothes, but he got no heat. Wherefore, his servants said, you know, when you're dropping dead, that spirit is bleeding. Yep. It's, you know, and that spirit is what's giving your body that that, that, that warmth. Heat. Yep. That, you know, is what got your part going. Oh, that because they say that it, that your spirit's more powerful than a nuclear power plant. That's, damn right. Yeah. Damn right. The yeah, spirit is pure energy. Pure from the Most High. You're right. From yeah, because the Most High is in us. You know. Yep. Um, but he got no heat. Wherefore his servant said unto him, Let there be salt for my lord the king, a young virgin. A, a young virgin. And let her stand before the king. And let her cherish him, and let her lie in thy bosom, that my lord, the king, may get heat. Now, he already had a wife, right? He already had a wife. So why did he bring in a virgin? Because they knew that's what got him excited. He likes, because a man likes a young, delicious, mm -hmm. beautiful woman. There's mm -hmm. nothing better in the world than a young, delicious, be beautiful woman. Right, because okay? yesterday I was with a girl I used to mess with in, uh, in the 90s, right? I mean, she's still pretty. Big, big booty, pretty titties. Yep. Giant, great big ass, but it's something I had before, and I wasn't turned on by this thing no more. So I need, I'm looking at this thing like, oh, she's old and worn out. I don't want nothing to do with it. And I didn't do it. I didn't, I didn't do it. I'm thinking in my mind, I need some young and sweet. You know, but you know, is these old women? But if you give a one example, I'm like, I'm like, Viagra, uh, the old right? I'm in my getting into my late 30s now, right? And uh, 
I don't want to get with a woman my age. Why? Because she done been with a thousand dudes. She got general herpes, got warts. A thousand dudes. You know what I'm saying? A thousand dudes and two thousand women. Right. She done been with a thousand dudes, two thousand women. She, done, <laughs> she got pornos all over the internet. Her own shit. Yeah, right. <laughs> so why I want to be with a woman like that? And you got to be careful getting a young one because a lot of girls, by the time they turn 18, they done been with a hundred women. I mean, a hundred men, excuse me. Well, and women. They're That's bisexuals the now. Oh, she was on the news actually today. That a high some high school kids got caught making their own porno. You I seen, seen that, that too? Yeah. You seen that? That's disgusting. Yeah. Because you know, going back to the Jew, don't you know the so-called Jew is behind the porno industry? And they're purposely trying to make us defile ourselves. Because because they they actually descend from Esau, and they think if they get us to break all these laws in the Bible, they'll get their promise back. Do right. you know who Esau is? Yeah. Who's Esau? Let me go. Ahead, yeah, that's too much. That's too deep. Okay, yeah, so they sought deep. for a fair damsel throughout all the coast of Israel and found. See, well, them girls, if any of them girls married, there's your oh, friends, right? Look at them. Are they married? Which ones are married? Which ones are married? None of them. None of them? I'm claiming. Which one y'all what? I'm, you can't do I'm claiming. Not, which one you're claiming? That's not the way it's supposed to go, though. I'm uh, claiming one uh, of the jeans. Uh, you can't uh, whatever, whatever you want, I'll take it. You don't do it like that. That is exactly no. how you do it. Yes, it is. <laughs> No. Yeah, we, that, we claim, once you claim something, that's yours. <coughs> Let me go one reach more this. And they found, and they found Abishad, oh, they shooting a mic, and brought her to the king. So this is a young virgin they brought to King David. And the damsel was very fair. She was very fair, like we just said, it. she's beautiful. These women are no more, ain't nothing fair and cheerful. Nah, these women are monsters. Gotcha. They and murdered she, their own babies, bro. Right. And the damsel was very fair and cherished the king and ministered to him, but the king knew her not. Exactly, he couldn't. They knew that. They knew when the king David can't get, couldn't, pretty much for lack of better words, get it up or whatever. They knew it was over. He was about to die because King David loved them young women. You know what I'm saying? Imagine uh, back then too how built they were. Oh, uh, they was they, they was eating right. They was following the laws. They were eating. Our women pork. back then were some precious things. Now don't you? Men, know, they're like pit bulls in a in a pit that you never cleaned out. Don't These you know? Women, but you never shit. Yep. <laughs> and they all eat pork. Oh, that's our women. Don't dude. you know when a woman eats pork and make and makes her private parts stink real bad? Don't yeah. you know that? Yeah. And the pork oozes yeah. out. They pores. Yeah. The woman's supposed to smell sweet. Yeah, they call it discharge. Yeah, you get some <laughs> some yeah. some. Oh, oh, oh. Swine destroy. I mean, that's true, bro. Uh, you can look uh, it up, it, man. It, it makes makes you makes you stink. Same with the man. Same it makes makes you stink. Same yep. thing with the man. Yep. 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 When you sweat, you can smell that shit. When you sweat. It, it come, oozes out your pores, bro. That's some shit. You come out the bathroom, you can smell like a goddamn uh, can of high humans just came out of it. You, know, you ain't supposed to, when you take a shit. You ain't supposed to smell that bad. And they ain't supposed to linger for hours either. Huh. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's all that nasty stuff they be yeah, eating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When you eat that pork, you defile your whole body. You see comedians be like, there's all kinds of comedians. Oh. Don't go in that bathroom, you know. Check this out. There's a scientific study that came out earlier this year, or late last year, and it said pork lowers your sperm count. Yeah. That's a scientific fact. Scientific, bro. Fact, Look it up. Google it. Fact. Fact. We, we deal with facts. Remember what I told you. Wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of that time. Not bullshit, okay? We ain't up here speaking bullshit. We speaking truth. We ain't no, no, no. gonna profit us deceiving you, man. We ain't gonna profit nothing from that, man. What we have to gain is giving you a false message. We give you 100% truth on the fact. Not even edited. Man, yeah, so false, man. Yeah, this is the bring anybody to this the director's cut. You know what I'm saying? You get the director's cut because the churches took all kind of scenes out of it. You know what I'm saying? This is the DX version. <laughs> That's right. You gonna get it way it's supposed to be coming out, man. Why do you think they hated the prophets, man? Why they do you think they killed. The Why did they saw off Isaiah's head? <laughs> Because they had this spot, because he spoke like us. They, he wasn't preaching that love. Yeah, he wasn't teaching no love. Oh, they was afraid of Samuel. Oh, smooth. Oh, yeah. They said they was afraid of Samuel. They was like, damn, Samuel, you know, when Samuel yeah, come they around, saw him coming, they, yeah, they, they got scared. scared. Here we go. Because oh, so they knew when the prophets I was on came scripture walking, too. They, was worried, they knew he'd come with bad news. Yep. So, so ain't no reason for the prophets oh. to come if they everybody falls in the laws. Exactly. If you everything's peaceful and happy, why you don't need prophets. Hey, that's why we're out here. I got a scripture. Right. That's why we're out here. 
Because we ain't got no good news. <laughs> Shit. And we are all prophets too, because the Bible said in Corinthians that ye must prophesy. It'd be yeah, right. Occupied and prophesy. Occupied. <laughs> yeah, scripture. The spiritual ass with it. Yeah, scripture. I know you are. You would say this to me. You should be feeling good. See that shit ain't right. They said it's very right. Both of your girls look good to me. I'm not afraid to say. But you can't. You can't. Oh they look delicious. You can't. That's not even. That's not even. I like women, and I love gingers. What are you talking about when the Bible and says? I got a special love for gingers. The Bible. <laughs> oh, me too. I love redheads. <laughs> exactly. There's it, almost know, nothing. That's why I wanted. What wanted to. Uh, What's that called? <laughs> yeah, redhead bitches are sexy as hell. Yeah. But the Bible says that we can snatch young virgins up That's in the field. That's why you preach the way that you preach, so that you can continue to justify yourself. No. First of all, don't you know, and actually, when you teach this word, it's a scare women away anyway. You know that, right? And the way we teach, they don't, hear they don't want to hear this. So that, the woman's the main one. Go Zimmerman. Zimmerman where? In that car. Might be. The passenger side. Oh, yes. He said Zimmerman. <laughs> side George? Yeah, you probably do. Oh, yep, you're right. There's a pound. Oh, he's a Jew. He's a Jew. He's a Jew. He's a Jew. A so called, not a true Jew, he's an Edomite. A so called Jew. They got a powerful Jewish lobby here in Columbus. Exactly. They just, they just had a story in the Columbus dispatch the other day. They said, how can we, uh, they said there's uh, too many poor Jewish people in Columbus, we gotta do something about it. And I'm like, that doesn't make any sense. What about all the poor black people? What about all the poor Irish people? Okay. And the poor Germans? I mean, that's true. You know what I'm saying? If you're poor, it's your fault. What? No. Huh? Yeah. And how's that? Huh? I'm not poor. Huh? Yes, you are. You're, very, you're a bum. Can we get a donation? No. Can we get a donation? Yeah, the scriptures say freely get freely received. Yeah, man. If I thought you were preaching the word, the truth. No, bro. Give you money. Who even said you we're ain't, out here preaching You was not rich. Are you? You got millions in the bank account. Here, here we go. No, but I got enough to pay for my bills. Man, you're pay you're for poor, my daughter. Bro. You're, you're still saving good money. In the eyes of this so-called Jew, you're a bum. You're a cockroach. There we go. Anyway, they want to exterminate. You. I live pretty comfortably. Yeah, yeah you're going, bro. You're going. You're going. In the eye of the so-called Jews. Let me get this for you. Uh, it says in 2 Chronicles 18 and 7. And the king of Israel said unto Jehoshaphat, There is yet one man by whom we may acquire of the Lord. But I hate him. For he never <laughs> prophesied good unto me. Uh, <laughs> hey, let's read that again. <laughs> 2 Chronicles 18 and 7. That's a good one. That's not one you hear all the time. <laughs> and the king of Israel said unto Jehoshaphat, There is yet one man by whom we may inquire of the Lord, but I hate him, <laughs> for he never prophesies good unto me. <laughs> he hates him because he's always <laughs> telling him the truth. The yeah. truth hurts. <laughs> Yeah. That's what we doing, man. Y'all telling people that lovey dovey <laughs> shit. Telling the faggot, devil worshiper. Oh, it's okay, brother. Just accept Jesus in your life. It's yeah, because okay. yeah, yeah, that's what you're supposed to do. That's that bullshit. Man. Now, this is here. you right here. This is Peace. Isaiah 29. And you guys have a good 13. day. God bless you. Wherefore the Lord said, For as much as this people draw near me with their mouth. That's all these churches. Especially the one you go to. And with their lips do honor me. You honor the Lord with your lips. Keep going. And but have removed their heart far from me. Yeah, because you was joking around earlier saying you like little boys. No. Come on, that's not even cool to say something like that. You're talking about lusting for women, bro, in a, in a, in a, in a serious, serious way. way. That's not, that's not that's the same. Not the that's same. totally different. You can justify it all you want, but it's still I, I, I need, right. I need, I need some wives. I need some. I need to have children so they can carry on my seed, my lineage. You're not looking to have kids, man. You have some kids. I have kids fear. already. Oh, man. And their fear toward me no, is all by the precepts of men. Say, that's that precepts of men. And yet, everything you're saying is the precepts of men. That's the doctrines and teachings of men. And it's not according to the holy word. 
the Lord. Which is this, see, see this Holy Bible. See, this is the instruction manual. Okay. Now you just preaching it, bro. No, we just reading it, bro, and it's plain. That's all we're doing. Reading. When you read it, it's plain. This is uh, let me get. Ezekiel 13 and 22. We ain't twisting their scripture. Because with lies ye have made the heart of the righteous sad, <laughs> whom I have not made sad, you know, and strengthened the hands of the wicked. Because you want to be brotherly, and you want other motherfucking Israelites to be brotherly too, because being brotherly, that's a cool ass fool to have. That's why he's out here right now. Yep. Man, but you gotta know we got rules we gotta follow. That's right. We can't just accept anybody into our thing. Not like You know what I'm saying? How we look like bringing a motherfucking nigga around here that's pushing kilos of cocaine every goddamn day? Oh, uh, Paul knows uh, somebody, uh, a dude is selling drugs. That's what just happened to him. Now, now the Lord the fucked his, shot his ass. Good. That was the Lord that shot his that's ass. That's the Lord's judgment. Let me finish this up. Uh, Ezekiel 13 and 22 because with lies ye have made the heart of the righteous sad So I, my fault right before you read that because if we hang out with people like that the Lord will kill us bro. That's right. That's okay, so and we fear the most high. You ever heard of guilty by association? That's where Esau got it from. He got it yeah. from the Bible. We're, we're scared to death of the most high because he will kill us. So we, we ain't nobody compared to the most high. Right. He will he will fuck us up. Before we kill you, he'll torment the shit out of you. So we, they, we, the, the Lord is very strict, okay? And we got to walk that straight gate. No. Uh, read that again, bro. Ezekiel 13 and 22. Because with lies ye have made the heart of the righteous sad, whom I have not made sad, and strengthened the hands of the wicked, that he should not return from his wicked way right. by promising him life. Yeah, you can't promise person. everybody life. You got... You they gotta tell them the truth. Wicked man, like. If somebody's being wicked and evil, you gotta tell them the truth. Like, look, yeah. the Lord's gonna kill you. The yeah. Lord will kill you. He, don't you know? If you but being you gotta wicked, love him too, man. That's nonsense. Yeah, you do. That's true. The Lord said, uh, uh, "I'll love him in the kingdom." Here you go, bro. This is Luke uh, 19 and 22. Uh, and he one. said unto him, "Out of thine own mouth will I judge thee, thou wicked servant." Thou knewest that I was an austere man. Now this is the Lord Himself speaking. Keep going. What does the word austere mean? I'm about to get it. Hold oh, on. Oh yeah, look at that. I got a dictionary. Austere. Now this is the, this is the Lord speaking. Oh, that's austere man. That's my red letters. Like they got austerity measures. You ever heard of those? That's right. Laws that the government passes that are pretty strict. On the, like for example, like a seatbelt. Seatbelt laws. That's an old shit. That's an example. Yeah, just bumping some Metallica. A lot of them fools don't even know where that comes from. Watch this. So the guy in the white car? Yeah. So you even, he was listening to Metallica. Like you even got James Hetfield from Metallica claiming he a Christian now. And he's still throwing up the devil. I don't know if he still throws up the devil horns. Everybody in this country. He does it all the fucking time. And he, yeah, he don't. Yeah. Look at, listen to this. This one. <laughs> Let me read it for you. You're so naive. <laughs> You're so naive. <laughs> no, that's what our that's what our social culture when they throw it up, that's what it means. Yeah. Oh yeah, rock out. Rock Actually it comes from a, 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 a Alistair Crowley. Yeah. I mean yeah, it could be satanic, but most people are Let me read this. The scriptures just said the Lord is an austere man, right? This is what austere means. It says this is the Lord. And he ain't talking about no love. Let me read the scripture first. I right, read it. 20, I'm gonna start Luke and Matthew 21. For I fear thee, because thou art an austere man. Thou takest up, that thou layest not down, and reapest, that thou dost not sow. And he said unto him, Out of thine own mouth will I judge thee, thou wicked servant. The Lord calls somebody wicked. Right. Thou a wicked servant. Right. <laughs> thou knewest that I was an austere man. He said, you knew I was, this is the Lord's own word. He said, you knew I'm austere. What is it? Now listen to what the word austere means. Severe or stern in disposition what? or appearance. So the Lord looked pissed off all the time. He was not happy. Look, somber, brave, strict or severe in discipline, ascetic, without adornment and ornamentation. I mean, he can't get around it, man. So he, like, like people always say, why y'all so angry? Y'all always so, you know what I mean? 
And I love it. Hey, keep reading that. Read, uh, skip down to 1927. He printed his own whip. 27? 1927. whole church's ass. Listen to this scripture. 1927. But those, my enemies, which was not said, okay. Yeah, read that for him. I was trying to read what that said in there. I was like, what does that say right there? You guys just, just read it and have a good time outside. Yeah, we having a wonderful time. That's right. Yeah, that's all, that's all you need to have, right? right? It's a beautiful evening, beautiful isn't it? Beautiful evening, right? Yes, it have a good night. You don't want to read with this? Oh, and she, she we don't teach me one. Only thing, there's only like one thing she could do for me, but. Can't even say that shit, man. <laughs> I can say it for sure. He just I, said I, it. No, she oh, wasn't. Her body was defiled, tattoos. She had hamite earrings. <laughs> tattoos, man. Hey, the Lord forgive you. Everybody got tattoos. No, I don't have a tattoo. I don't have a tattoo. Nobody got tattoos. No, I don't have any tattoos. No, you're not wicked just because you have tattoos. No. If you have tattoos before you get into truth, the Lord will forgive you. Okay. That's right. That's right. There's no, I mean. That's right. That's right. But read 1927. Some people would admit that they were wrong. They were wrong. Here you go, 1927. Right. But those my enemies, which would not that I should reign over them. Listen, if the Lord said, though, my enemies, the Lord said he has enemies. Right. Read it. But those my enemies, which would not that I should reign over them, bring hither and slay them before me. The Lord said it. Oh, he died. <laughs> that was the killing scripture right there, boy. That's spiritual. See, that's spiritual. I wouldn't even pick him up. Just let him go, yeah, just bro. Just leave him alone, man. Just let him go. That's fucked up. That put the icing on the cake right there. The birds are going to have a good oh, time. Oh, yeah, the birds. Yeah, there you go. Put the icing on the cake right there. <laughs> Stick a fork in and he's done. That's the, the, the scripture made a, a steam go through his heart. <laughs> made, a, made a jump. <laughs> hey, the scripture said men's hearts shall fail. For fear of the thing coming The Lord said he got enemies and he said, bring him over here and slay him before me. <laughs> <laughs> He also said he's gonna rule with a rod of iron too. What do you do with a rod of iron? You hit people over side of hell with it. Oh, here we go. I got scripture. This is uh, Hebrews 13 and 8. You my nigga, man. You a cool motherfucker. <laughs> Jesus Christ, the same right. yesterday. Hey, he gonna be an Israelite. And he today. Him, my fault. We, we, we uh, interrupted. My, my, my sorry. I don't go. <laughs> This is uh, Hebrews 13 and 8. Jesus Christ, the same yesterday and today oh, and he's forever. A, the same. He don't never change. That means from the old to the new. He, he don't give a damn what kind of fun coming out of him. Right. Tyson with singing and pretty words. Get a, yeah, because yeah, the Lord himself, he didn't have no women. Right. He had more. Because you know what a woman does? A woman is a distraction. She'll, she'll get in the way of you teaching this truth. If you, you come out here and teach like us, I guarantee you, those little women, you know, little fine ass women you had in your church. Well, they don't go to my church. Well, oh, whatever. Listen to me. If they seen us, say I got with one of those girls, and I told her like, "Look, baby, I might go teach this Bible on the street, and I'm gonna wear this too when I do it." She's like, "I don't know, you ain't. You ain't gonna be with me." That's what she's gonna say, and then she's gonna leave me. Guarant, 100% guarantee. 100%. Even though she claims to love the Lord. But if I go and do the work of the Lord mm, with all boldness, mm, out in the open so everybody can see me, make fun of me, spit at me. And most of them know about the brothers being on the corner street. Yep. On the streets. There we go. They uh, know about it, so they're going to they hear, they, they know beforehand that you're going to hang it up, man. It's best, not, it's best not even tell that bitch. Right. So pretty, that, right? pretty much, because the scriptures say, give not they strength to the woman. That's right. So you, you, you treat a woman. Uh, like a mushroom, that's an old saying. You treat her like a mushroom, you put her in a dark closet and feed her up with shit. That's what, how you treat her. What she need to know what you're doing? What's, why she need to know? None of her business. What? That's what you do. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> you know, hey, we learn by examples, man. You know? All right, all right go ahead. If you, if you start teaching your woman these scriptures, she's going to leave you. Guaranteed. 100% guaranteed. You ain't got a woman no more. Goodbye, woman. Now, every once in a while, there's an exception to the rule. Y'all have that. Shit, these bitches all the time. Well, you know, I'm just they saying. They do that bitch. Mm. Right. Fucking niggas behind you. You know? Yeah. You can't trust not one of these bitches. And not one of them. 
But every once in a while, just for the camera, you got women uh, okay. watch our videos. So every, you know what I mean, every one or two, not that many. And we get that scripture to prove it. It, it says it in the Bible, Ecclesiastes 7. Oh, go ahead, read that. <laughs> this is, uh... See, we gotta bring this out. We ain't thinking about how the women will be feeling out of the video. The only thing one was good for is sex. This is uh, John 6, John 6 and 64. But there are some of you that believe not, for Jesus, for Jesus knew from the beginning who they were that believed not, and who should betray him. And he said, therefore said I unto you that no man can come unto me except it were given unto him of my father. <laughs> You know, the father, right? So, you can't, you can't choose him. You already got to put it in you. Who's that? Who's that? Yeah, I got to bring this in. Please, yes, you real quick. Yep, yep. Let me get this. Uh, I'm just going straight to the point. Ecclesiastes 7 and 26. And I find more bitter than death the woman whose heart is snares and nets. And her hands is banned. Uh, he said, nah, 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 nah. nah. Yeah, I can't nah, talk about women like nah, that. You uh, may go tell Solomon, King Solomon, and talk yeah. about a woman like right. that. Uh, Who was more wise than King Solomon? He had a lot of women, he should know. Right, right, right. It said, yeah. Whoso, listen, whoso pleaseth God, do you please of God? Listen, whoso pleaseth God shall escape from her. What? But the sinner shall be taken by her. Now listen to this. Behold. This I have found, saith the preacher, counting one by one to find out the account. Jesus. Yet which my soul seeketh, but I find not one man among a thousand have I found. But, let, but a woman among all those have I not found. So all these churches got number of women in it. So you know that shit ain't right. Yeah, they say get their money, because a woman is stupid. You can whisper a little sweet, soft words in her ear, and she'll give you all her money, bro. You can listen to even if it's a lie. That's, you know what I'm saying? That's why in the Garden of Eden, the serpent went to the woman. He didn't go to Adam first, first. He went to the woman. Aww. Yeah, Adam would've beat the shit out of the serpent. He would've punched him right in his face. But see, but it was the woman went to Adam, and then Adam was weak. It was the woman. Submit or just be destroyed. Matthew 15 and 24, but he answered and said, I am not sent, but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. The Lord came to save Israel from their sins. Hey, buddy, wait until you look at him too, man. Dude look, come on, this dude looks like a big weirdo. Come on, man. Game And I'm not one to judge people by their appearance. But so I can see his spirit. But goddamn. But his spirit, yeah, right. But goddamn, right. Come on, that dude look like a big weirdo. Right. There we go. Uh, the uh, scripture speaks about how uh, dressing up Asian, Asian man. man. There we go. Uh, uh, Asian man. We can that see. I know Bruce Lee was an Asian, but he was cool as hell. Bruce, you know Bruce Lee's an Israelite. 
But that's like the, the way that they dress now. Man. No, no, no. Asian, the culture, the Chinese no, culture, no. they dress like that. Man, man, if he's over there in China, they probably curse his ass out and call him a big faggot. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, no, you faggot. Yeah. You big faggot. Here, let me get this. Uh, Matthews 10 and 34. Think not that I am come to send peace on earth. Ain't gonna be no peace. I came not to send peace. But a sword. A sword. That's, that's why, in red letters. And that's, that's what you got. That's why you got. If the Lord was so loving, then why how come, come that? And how come the history of the earth is filled with nothing but war? That's, a good, that's a good question, man. Very good. You could go to Johnny Knoxville. The, actually, the scriptures say the Lord. The scriptures say the you Lord. You guys are coming here tomorrow, right? No. <laughs> yeah. No. I'm not gonna be out here tomorrow. Thirty D. I would like to be out here tomorrow, but I can't do it. Hey, he's how you gonna pay me. You guys have a good night. All right, man. Take it easy. Jesus, love. Yeah. What time are you coming out here? <laughs> what time are you coming? Hey, you're you not gonna be here. I'm not gonna come. What time are you coming out here, man? Are you all gonna be here? I'm gonna be here. I mean, if, if you really, I could come out here. I have my what children with me. Let's say. What time is it right now? Oh, like, like, let's say five. Buses. Avoid the hot, avoid the, uh, <laughs> watch, both, watch both ways. Oh, yeah. Both ways across the street. Make sure you look up, too. <laughs> Don't forget to, to look that. up. I was about to say And it's a scripture that says to look up. <laughs> and look down. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah, look left, right, and down. Don't know where down. the Lord is going to come from him. He, he didn't want to leave. He was getting no. so fucked up. I know. He was like, his spirit was on, man. You read that scripture out of Luke. Oh, yeah. Don't even see. There goes his uh, seeds. He's gonna be all messed up now. He had a quick swallow. He had a good swallow. Hey, you know, every time you heard him come up here, in the beginning, he always be playing that fucking cracking jokes and shit. And then after a while, when he gets real neck deep, he goes to all kinds of bullshit. Yeah, yeah, he gets <laughs> silent. He <laughs> <laughs> quiet as hell. He did that last time. But, but he was joking about some weird shit. Isn't it funny though. how he was. He was supposed to have been going that way. Yeah, he was going that way. Oh, he was going that way. <laughs> well, then he was going then, where he oh, he I think he's going to church, but he missed it. He, <laughs> he missed it. He got the real church. You know what I'm saying? Because right, right, he right. was going that way. He was going, <laughs> going to church. Yeah, his church is down that yeah, way. He was going to church. Man, he was coming out here looking for us. <laughs> yeah, that's what he was looking for. Yeah, that could be fucking going. That's why he had them sunflower seeds with him. He wasn't about to go eat them in church. This boy is gone, man. He's a goner for sure. Hey, he ain't coming yeah, out of that. Hey, there ain't no coming out of that. Hell no, ain't no coming out of that. Ain't no coming out of that. Ain't never gonna be the same. Yeah, it's gone. I'm surprised he ain't gonna have. He gonna have Freddy Krueger in.